Stella Penna from St. Walter's Children's Faith Formation with a special message for those of you having to wait to receive your first Holy Communion. Wow, it's tough to wait, isn't it? I mean, by now you had your special outfit already picked out. Your parents and family were getting ready to have a celebration for you. That's because your first Holy Communion is a big deal. In fact, it's one of the most important days of your entire life. And now, because of COVID-19, you're going to have to wait to celebrate your First Holy Communion. As I was thinking about you the other day, I started thinking about a friend of ours in heaven and what she used to do when she had to wait to receive communion. Her name was St. Bernadette Subaru. Bernadette lived a long time ago in a town of Lourdes in France. She came from a very poor family and was one of six children. Bernadette also used to be very sick. In fact, she, got, she was so sick when she was about your age that she missed a lot of school. And because of that, she really wasn't a very good student. But Bernadette had a deep, deep love for Jesus and for the Blessed Mother. One day, when Bernadette's mom had sent her out to collect firewood, the Blessed Mother appeared to her in person. In fact, the Blessed Mother appeared to Bernadette a total of 18 times. She had messages for Bernadette as well as for the entire world. There's a lot more I'd like to tell, to, tell you about St. Bernadette. And I'm going to put some information that you can look at and a video you can watch in the comments section of this video. But right now, I want to tell you about something that happened to Bernadette when she was older. You see, later in life, Bernadette became very ill and could not attend Mass for a very long time. This made her so sad because she never felt closer to God than when she received Jesus in the Eucharist. So then Bernadette came up with a pretty smart idea. She took a picture of the Eucharist and put it in her bedroom window so that when she saw it and when she looked at it, she would remember to say a prayer while she was waiting to go to communion. You see, when she would wake up in the middle of the night, if she was scared or lonely or just didn't feel well, she would look at her window and see that picture and suddenly she would feel better because she remembered that Jesus was with her. You know, I think Bernadette just gave us a great piece of advice all the way from heaven. So here's my challenge for you boys and girls. In the comment part of this video, I'm gonna put lots of pictures of Eucharist. Some you can color, some pictures will look like stained glass. Others may even look just like photographs. If you don't have a printer at home, that's okay. You can just go ahead and draw your own picture of Eucharist. But I want you to take that piece of artwork, whether you print it out and color it or draw your own, I want you to hang it in your own bedroom window, just like Bernadette did. And each day when you see that, I want you to say a simple prayer. I'll post the prayer in the comment section of this video, but right now I'm going to share it with you. And it goes just like this. Jesus, I love you. Jesus, I trust you. I promise to be patient while I receive you in Holy Communion. Jesus is going to be so excited to hear your prayer and so excited to see that picture of artwork in your, in your bedroom window. So this is the picture that I'm going to hang in my own window. And every time I see it, I'm going to remember to say a prayer for you. And I promise to ask Jesus to make your first communion even more special because you had to wait. Now here's the next part. I want everyone to take a picture of you standing right by your piece of artwork in your window and send it to me. I'm going to put my email in the comments section of this video. If your parent doesn't want you in the picture, that's okay. But just send me then a copy or picture of your artwork 
because I'm going to do something very special for you for your first Holy Communion. So, finally, boys and girls, this coming Saturday, we're going to have an 8.30 Mass online, and that particular Mass is going to be offered up for you, those of you waiting to receive your first Holy Communion. Plus, you can also notice on this weekend, we will have a special intention for you at all the Sunday Masses. You can watch Sunday Mass, in fact, any Mass at St. Walter's online using our YouTube channel. You can find us on Facebook, or you can go to our parish website and live stream us anytime that there is Mass. You see, even in the middle of COVID-19, Jesus finds a way to bring us closer to him and to each other. So that's all for now, boys and girls. Remember, send me your photograph with your artwork. Stay safe, stay well, and I look forward to seeing you soon. St. Bernadette, pray for us. Bye for now.